What is up, YouTube? This is Owen Dow here, and uh, it is December the 24th, 2018, which is Christmas Eve. It is 11.40, which you can actually see up there on my Zippo clock, which I got. That's actually a Christmas present from, I think, 2012? Maybe 2013. Uh, I can't remember. I think that might be a 2013, but, uh, yeah, anyway, Merry Christmas Eve. I'm going to be doing this, uh, my usual Christmas Eve video for you guys. Um, I'm going to try and keep this one a little short because as you can see, I'm at my, uh, in my usual room, which means that I am using my grandma's Wi-Fi, which is complete and utter. It just is not very good with upload speeds. So I want to upload this tonight if I can. So. Heck, I might even just use LTE, honestly. <laughs> um, we'll see. I don't really care. Uh, but yeah, just wanted to give you guys the video. Um, don't really have a whole lot to show for you guys in this video. Now, I will say that we did things a little bit differently uh, this year. We did Christmas before Christmas Eve. Yeah. The reason why is because tomorrow, bright and early, we're going to be going to Raleigh. So I actually have to get up pretty early in the morning to uh, go to my parents' house, and we're going to do stockings there. Um, and then we're going to go straight to Raleigh um, to visit my <clears throat> my other family. And, um, yeah, that's going to be fun. We're going to hang out with them. Uh, a few of them weren't able to make it up here, but we they wanted to see us, so we're going to go up to Raleigh and, and see them there. So, yeah, that's what we're doing. Um, so, in terms of things I got, now, I got several things for Christmas Eve. Uh, I will actually be showing these in my gift showcase video. Um, I'm actually going to be showing you one thing in this video, and the one thing I'm going to be showing you I actually got yesterday, the day before Christmas Eve. Um, actually, yesterday is technically Christmas Eve for you guys because of when this is going up. But uh, yeah, I got this on the, <clears throat> on the night before Christmas Eve. Um, so what I'm going to be showing you is uh, the big gift, I guess. And this actually... Kind of, I'm not going to do it here, but this is going to kind of segue me into a point that I will be making a uh, update video at some point for you guys because there are a few little things, little changes that had to be made to uh, the way that I was planning on doing things next year. Um, but I'm going to get to that. Probably won't get to that until next year um, in January, but just a couple, little, just a little tiny thing. Uh, but anyway, this is actually kind of related to that because this is a gift that was bought with the uh, thought that things were going to go as planned, um, if you know what I mean. So here it is. I got a Google Home Mini. Yeah, this is something that I never would have bought myself. I mean it. And I'm super interested. You'll note it's still in its wrapper. That's because I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to set it up, where I'm going to put it, how I'm going to use it. Once I think I've figured out how I'm going to use it, then I'll go ahead and open it up. Um, but yeah, if y'all don't know what a Google Home Mini is, it's basically like a little personal assistant for your home made by Google. So if you have an Android phone, you can say, hey, Google, and then, or I think you say, okay, Google, and then it will just, um, it'll start listening to you, and then you can ask it what the weather is, or like, take you, play your favorite song, or call someone, you know what I mean? You can do stuff like that. Essentially, the Google Home Mini is a, uh, kind of an extension to that, but I believe you can also use this with iPhones, which I hope you can, because that's what I have. <laughs> I have an iPhone. So, but yeah, it's pretty cool. Uh, I'm not planning on doing an unboxing. If you guys would like to see an unboxing, now is the time to speak up. Um, if I get enough people saying that they want to see an unboxing of the Google Home Mini, then I will do one, but I'm not really planning on doing an unboxing of it. Um, I am actually going to be showing you one more thing, but, uh, it's not really a Christmas gift. It's something that I kind of bought for myself. But as you all know, I technically graduated college. Now, there you go. I, I went ahead and kind of gave you guys part of the update. I technically graduated college um, this year. So unfortunately, I was going to give you a little scoop of it. Unfortunately, I found out I have to retake a class. Um, so I'm going to be here another semester. That's essentially the, the gist of the update video I was talking to you guys about. But I did graduate college. I went to a graduation ceremony. I walked and, uh, you know, they insist that even if you have to retake a class, you should still walk and you should still be with your class because they're your friends and, you, you know, you want to celebrate with them. And I was really happy that they let me do that. That was awesome. So I bought myself something that I've wanted for a, mm, it's not been out very long. It came out last year, but I've wanted it 
since it was announced. I found myself a Nintendo Switch. And, uh, wow. Guys, this thing is amazing. Seriously. I have not played video games basically the entire time that I've been in university. Uh, I really just haven't. Um, I got it. I do have a 3DS. Which is... Is it in here? I don't think my 3DS is in here to be a visual... And my Nintendo Switch isn't in here either, uh, because it's it's just in the living room. I don't like to bring that into my bedroom. I feel like I want to have a boundary from that thing, so I don't bring the Nintendo Switch into my bedroom. I just charge it on the little on the little dock thing that it comes with right there. So I just charge it on that. Uh, I did bring it in here the night I got it, and I think I brought it in here one other night because I had it in my backpack and I just didn't feel like setting everything up, so I brought it back here anyway. But yeah, for the most part, that thing lives in the living room. But I got myself a Nintendo Switch. Um, there's the other side of the box for y'all, as you can see. And uh, yeah, it's it's really fun. I got, oh shoot, I meant to grab it. I got myself a copy of the new Super Smash Bros. Ultimately, that's what broke me into getting the Nintendo Switch. I knew as soon as the new Super Smash Bros. came out that I was going to strongly consider buying a Switch. And sure enough, once the new Super Smash Bros. came out, I didn't get it the day of, but I got it about, I got it this past Monday, so, or like, today is Monday, I got it a week ago today, so, I think it's been out, I think it was out for about a week when I bought the Nintendo Switch, and, uh, yeah, I also bought a set of Joy-Cons, uh, to go with it. For those of you who don't know what the Nintendo Switch is, there's kind of one of the features of the Nintendo Switch, is that the consoles can be used in, t or, I'm sorry, the Joy-Cons can be used in tandem as one controller, or you can use them as two controllers. Um, and the neat thing is that the Switch comes with two Joy-Cons, so you can use it correctly, and so that means out of the box, literally, you can do two-player things, which is amazing. I really think Nintendo thought this through very well. This is one of, if not the coolest gaming consoles I've ever seen. But, uh, yeah, I did buy myself a Nintendo Switch, and I am loving it. If you guys would like to see a video on the Nintendo Switch... Again, just send me, post a comment down below, and I will consider it. I don't really know what I'll do, but I'll show it to you guys. I'll give you a little tutorial of how it works and all that stuff in case you are interested in seeing one in action if you don't know what they are. But I think at this point, everybody knows what Nintendo Switch is. There's, like, very few people that don't seem to know what a Nintendo Switch is. So, yeah. Um, anyway, guys, I do think that's going to do it. Um, oh, shoot. I was going to show you all something. I just kind of remembered a puzzle, something that I got last year. Um, I don't know why I'm showing you guys this, because frankly, it's embarrassing. But this thing that I got last year, I still have not figured out how to solve this. <laughs> it This thing has seriously defeated me. I have no idea how to do it. Um, I might wind up looking up a tutorial uh, in the near future, because I really do want to be able to play with it, like see this thing solved again you know what i mean um so yeah anyway that's gonna do it for this video i this video got a lot longer than i wanted it to and uh like i say i will be doing the uh gift showcase where i'll show y'all everything uh everything's out there i don't really feel like getting it but yeah i did want to come out here and at least show you guys the the google home mini um it'll be super interesting to see what i do with that and, um, yeah, if y'all have a Google Home Mini, you know, tell me, what do y'all use it for? Uh, I typically think of Google Home Minis or, like, Google Homes as being in the, uh, kitchen. Uh, I, I think of stuff like that as being in the kitchen where you can wake up and then while you're getting your morning coffee, you can be like, okay, Google, what's the weather like today? Or, okay, Google, you know, set the mood or I don't, maybe not set the mood. That might be, <laughs> that might not be the proper thing to say to it in the morning, but, um, you know, like, you know play some music or whatever, turn on the radio, I don't know, but, uh, yeah, anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and kill it here, guys, happy holidays, Merry Christmas, happy Hanukkah, whatever you're celebrating, I know there's plenty more than that, but whatever you're celebrating, I hope you had a good one, and, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and go, so thank you all for watching, see y'all in my next video, adios.